And this slide again summarizes uh, of your how we have to do that. But the uh, next slide more uh, clearly uh, describes of the outline of the science. Next slide, please. Okay. And right now, uh, life sciences is supported by the dogma called central dogma. So DNA makes RNA, makes proteins. So everything is uh, considered on the basis of the central dogma. So if you would like to eat something, maybe something happened in the basis of DNA or RNA or protein. In fact, if you feel that warm after uh, in the dark side, if you uh, you know cycling and then stop because the cat is suddenly come out. What happened? After maybe 10 seconds, you feel warm, right? That happened because DNA makes some transcription machinery is making the RNA, which is making the protein, which is utilized ATP to uh, protect itself. Therefore, this enzyme is made by DNA, from made DNA. So everything is we are, everything is based on uh, consider central tokens. DNA makes RNA makes protein. At the same time, after uh, after uh, genome uh, project, we understand all the information about DNA. <clears throat> However, we don't know that some biomolecules, which is not made by central dogma, for example, some a, a, a metabolic intermediate, which is not made by central dogma. So some enzyme convert some component into the another uh, compound. So these are not uh, on central dome. So we will know that other uh, biomolecules, which is working on together with the central dogma to control of the human beings. How to do that? So we try to identify in the function, uh, we, we try to identify these factors, but we try to study the function of these uh, proteins. But this induction uh, study has uh, the limitations. So do you know that how many factors has to be identified? Or can you integrate of the each function into the uh, some uh, phenomenon? So we cannot do that. So therefore, we try to understand human homeostasis by deduction method by using a supercomputer, so in silicon. So data mining, data processing, data integration, we try to make virtual human inside of your supercomputer. That's realize that we may, if we can make the, the uh, virtual human in the computer, maybe the, this computer is very good for screening of the new drugs or uh, to study of the effect of some unknown compound. So something happening, instead of using animals, just using virtual supercomputers, virtual human sciences and computers. To this end, we have to integrate many kind of your research fields, such as structural biology, molecular methodology, nanotechnology, chemical biology, computer sciences, system engineering, robotics, sports science, even recognition science and technology, and so on. So therefore, we have to run so many things. The next slide, please. And uh, to achieve that, uh, we try to uh, include variety kind of your uh, research fields into this human biology PhD program. And this is too uh, precise. Therefore, next slide show you more uh, a brief uh, structure. Next slide. And therefore, right now, University of Tsukuba has at an eight. Uh, graduate schools, uh, humanities, social sciences, business sciences, right, and environmental sciences, library and information sciences, systems, information engineering, pure, applied sciences, comprehensive human sciences, and so on. And then to achieve that problem aim, we integrate of their science into this human biology PhD program. Some professors uh, come from humanity. Some professors come from life and environmental sciences. Some professors come from pure applied sciences. Some uh, from comprehensive human sciences to construct of 
multi and close disciplinary and leading edge uh, graduate school programs. Okay? Next slide, please. Next slide, please. And then, <coughs> uh, this slide summarizes the complete uh, professor's uh, members. And probably you can't understand what's going on there. But the uh, next slide show you. Not only the university professors, but also professors from leading companies, private companies, and uh, foreign university and institute. These are members of the professor for this program. So usually you can go and some Japanese professors, but you can choose that. Not only Japanese professor and the University of Tsukuba, but also the professors from private companies and some very famous uh, uh, foreign uh, institute. Okay? Next slide, please. And then uh, this is the summary of your curriculum structure, and which will be uh, explained by a uh, uh, professor in minutes. Next slide, please. And then I would like just to emphasize that this program started with five-year program. This uh, program started with the, uh, some kind of the comprehensive uh, a, a subject, not only uh, uh, not only the uh, so mathematics or computer sciences, but the molecular or medical or some other uh, subject. And that's uh, you choose some and you can learn. And then after that. You try to do that some research uh, work uh, for maybe the year, uh, complete with three years with the, uh, some parts of the year, uh, second years. And then during these activities, next slide please, and you have to take uh, these kind of research related subject. For example, advanced international research rotation in which you have to take that year as some subject or experimental procedure with foreign professors. So you, you can go outside of the Japan and collaborate uh, with the foreign professors. Advanced internship in overseas company. So you can choose some company and you can go out and then carry out internship in uh, overseas companies. Advanced appropriate technology so maybe you can go in the, uh, some area where uh, the people need new technology. There, and probably student try to develop on the very simple but the new technology for the people in these areas. In fact, uh, this summer, uh, several students went go to the uh, East Timor, uh, where no electricity, there is no water or purification system, but they try to do something new. And this is another subject. And other, uh, advanced entrepreneurship, where you can learn the, how to start up of the company itself. Okay? So these are not only uh, research works, but also the, uh, these research data subjects are very, very specific uh, subject in this program. Next slide, please. And then this slide is a summary of advantage of this program, but uh, uh, this will be explained by later in another professor, more detail, okay? Therefore, I skip it. And then this slide, again, uh, the uh, summary of the uh, student support, but uh, this will be deep, more carefully and uh, in detail explained by Professor Takahashi later. Okay, next slide, please. Next slide. And therefore, uh, just uh, I would like to finish of the uh, introduction uh, session of this PhD program. But uh, this slide summarizes that uh, after uh, running in this program, you probably uh, get some ability uh, related to the specialist skill, or nice judgment, or breakthrough uh, power, or conclusive actions, uh, to a solution of the global scale problem, and you should be the leader for the, this uh, Nobel uh, a, a world uh, a, a society. And probably, next one is the last one. Uh, ne next one, please. Okay, and then uh, you will, okay, student, you will learn about more uh, the PhD program in human biology. 
But if you want to know more about University of Tsukuba, please get back to your uh, Nature Journal, Science Journal, uh, 468, page 133348, and uh, 2010, November 11th issues. There is the uh, summary of University of Tsukuba and the city of Tsukuba, and then Nature. So probably there, any kind of the research uh, uh, student know that what kind of the, uh, this journal, how value uh, nature is. So let's look at it, okay? Uh, November 11th issue, uh, 2010. So you, you can know more about University of Tsukuba and City of Tsukuba. Okay, thank you very much, the student in uh, Ho Chi Minh City. Thank you very much for the uh, student in Myogadani and uh, thank you very much for the student in uh, uh, Tsukuba campus. Okay, thank you very much.